If you're looking to screen record your iPhone, your iPad, or even your iPod Touch, these are your best options for 2018. The following screen recorders are all for iOS 11 devices. If you're stuck on iOS 10, jump to this point in the video for an app that will work for you. The quickest and easiest way to screen record on iOS 11 is through the built-in screen recorder. To enable it, go to Settings, then Control Center, followed by Customize Controls. Scroll down this list until you see Screen Recorder, and then press the green plus button to add it to your active functions in the Control Center. Now when you're on any screen, bring up the Control Center and you should see this Record button. Force touch it to bring up the single option, which is to record through the microphone. If this is not selected, your screen recording will record system sounds but no external noise. For a full beginner's guide on how to use this, check out the video link on screen now. The built-in screen recorder is generally good, but it does have some annoying bugs that sometimes prevent microphone audio from being heard in video editors. An application that can fix this issue is called TechSmith Capture, and it's available from the App Store currently for free. The way this works is by using the built-in iOS 11 screen recorder, but then saving the video to its own application. When you export the video out of this application to your photo app, it fixes the audio issues so that you can then edit the video or upload to YouTube and still hear microphone sounds. Once installed, simply go to the control center, force touch the record button and set your recording to TechSmith Capture. At the moment, this is a great fix for problems with the built-in screen recorder. However, you do need to create a TechSmith account and this app might not always be free. For more information on this app, watch this video. While the iOS screen recorder and TechSmith get the job done, there aren't that many features to play with. If you want a bit more control over your screen recordings, however, you can try an app called VidU. This app isn't available from the App Store, so you will have to point your Safari browser to appvalley.vip forward slash app. On this screen, tap on library at the bottom, then apps, and then scroll down to the app called VidU. When you reach this screen, tap get to install it. Before you can use it, however, you will need to trust the certificate attached to the app or you will hit an error. To trust the certificate, go to settings, scroll down to profile and device management, tap on the certificate, it could be any name, then tap the blue words and the red trust button on the pop-up. If you're not sure what signed certificates are or how they work, watch this video and as a disclaimer, you download any application from outside of the App Store at your own risk. VidU works in a very different way to the built-in screen recorder and there are a lot more options to play with. That deserves a video in itself and it's on screen right now. Next up is live streaming. Yes, it can be done direct from an iOS 11 device and it's free. Omelette Arcade is the app you want from the App Store. You will need to create an account and you can live stream to several services including Facebook, Twitch or YouTube, which is incredible. You will need to link Arcade Omelette to your YouTube account and it's activated by going to the control center, force touching the record button and switching to Omelette to broadcast. As impressive as this is, live streaming on iOS devices is still very limited as there's no ideal way to interact with your live audience, which kind of defeats the object of live streaming. Lots more about this on the video on screen now. Finally, if you are either stuck on iOS 10 or have chosen to stay on iOS 10, there is one screen recorder I always recommend and that's Airshow version 061. You can get it from the same location as VDU, which is to point your Safari browser to appvalley.vip forward slash app. Go to the same list and just below VDU, you should find Airshow. From there, the installation process is the same. Tap on Get. Once the application is installed, go to Settings, Trust the Certificate, and that should get you into the app. To be clear, this screen recording version of Airshow only works on iOS 10 or below. It does not work on iOS 11, and as you download this application from outside of the App Store, you do so at your own risk. This is a screen recorder I've covered in monumental detail. Links on screen now. Hey everyone, my name is Rob. Welcome to the Video Gadgets Journal. If this is your first time here, my mission on this channel is to help you screen record your iOS devices and share them with the world. I go into a lot more detail on videos I post regularly on the channel, so subscribe for a lot more content. Thank you for watching. Enjoy the rest of your tech day. Bye for now.